Hello, my dear friends, and we come to the end of our series on St. Joseph and that beautiful relief we have in the church. Now, we focus on something that seems a little early, the birth of Christ, the Nativity. And what does the Nativity have to do with this charism of St. Ambrose? To give thanks with a grateful heart? Because that's what Christmas is all about. Giving thanks to God with all of our heart for the greatest gift we could ever receive our salvation, Christ, our brother, our Lord, our master, and our joy. At that first Christmas, were things perfect? Far from it, but they had all they needed. They had Jesus, and that's what we have here. Are our lives always perfect? No, sometimes they're far from it. And sometimes we let anger and bitterness and gossip creep into our life as Catholics. And here at St. Ambrose, we try to soothe the wounded heart, to build others up, not tear them down, to be a place of peace and joy and comfort, not of rancor and division. We are here to help others know the joy of God and help ourselves know God's joy in us as his sons and daughters, as sinful as we might be. We are called to be washed clean, to be picked up and move forward, to do that for others in our different ministries, through our vibrant school, through our worship, through the sacraments, through everything that goes on here, giving thanks like that first Christmas at Bethlehem, knowing we have Christ, and with Christ, we have all we need. Did Joseph know the full extent of his work as foster father at Christmas? No, his heart was so overcome with joy and gratitude, he knew God would take care of him. And God will take care of us here at St. Ambrose. For that's Jesus' promise, I am with you always. May God bless you and yours during these summer days.